case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In Wilson v. Clancy, a United States District Court for the District of Maryland case from 1990, a person unsatisfied with their inheritance sued the attorney who wrote the will for malpractice, claiming the attorney was negligent in drafting the will and did not properly carry out the testator's wishes. The attorney in question had drafted a last will and testament in 1987 for Dr. Thomas A. Herney, which left valuable assets in a joint property that was ultimately passed directly to Dr. Herney's wife outside the will. The plaintiff alleged that the attorney was guilty of malpractice for not advising Dr. Herney to transfer the jointly held property to his sole ownership for the will to be effective. However, the defendant insisted that they had discussed property transfer with Dr. Herney and that there was no duty to change the ownership. As the case went to court on a summary judgment motion, the court dismissed the plaintiff's claim due to insufficient evidence against the defendant's testimony. With Dr. Herney deceased, the plaintiff could not provide competent evidence disputing the defendant's account, and an additional affidavit was deemed too speculative for the jury. Consequently, the court granted summary judgment in favor of the defendant, and the plaintiff was held responsible for paying the case costs. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.